Okay, honey, where are we? Hi, we are in Ernest Hemingway's boat Pretty in cool. the Sportsman's Paradise in um, Alamorada. There's Hemi. There's Hemingway, and this is his actual boat. Having a little snort there in that picture. Yeah, he's having a little nap picture too. That's right. amazing. So I hear he had a, a, a glass writing. once in a while. Tipped a few. Years when he was wow, a lot younger. Here's the, is this the, what they call the galley? Oh, those little fish pictures. But this is a pretty cool boat. It's uh, really nice. It's all wood. Pretty neat. This is You're up in the, uh, the, the foresail. She knows that boat stuff. <laughs> They're very short people in those days. <laughs> It's a, little, it's a little tight. It's padded. Here. They're very short people who slept in these. Yeah, these are the uh, cushions that you sleep. This is a closet. Ooh. It's a nice. And then uh, this is the head, but they have it locked. Just in case someone decides to use it, because a lot of people in the Keys yes, have a beer once or twice at least. that's very true. And then there's the little dining area. Mm-hmm. Very this is actually a pretty cool boat. It's right? pretty well made, yeah. Yeah, it's really nice. Beams in the same. Yeah. There's a little place where he where he rode, I guess. <laughs> Not really. I doubt he rode on the boat. You know. Kinda too busy catching fish and drinking a lot. But this is like a really cool boat. <laughs> Here's the uh the steering wheel and here is made out of really cool wicker. Wicker, that's the word I was looking for. It has little dials and stuff. Very cool. And this is called the it's called the uh, MV motor vessel Pilar. Built in 1933 in the Weeks Boatyard, Brooklyn, New York. Length is 43 and 6 inches. Beam is 13.5. And the draft is only 3.8, so it's perfect for the keys. A nice chart and everything. Really, really cool. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. Can I hear huh? something cooler? Sure. Look at the guy in the picture. Is that you? Yeah. Oh, how cool. This is an actual person that, that really? met Hemingway? <laughs> oh, not Hemingway. Jesus. Oh, okay. <laughs> You'd be <too> really <laughs> old. <laughs> no. That's uh, Gregorio Fuentes. I went to him and met him there. Wow, very cool. You just never know who you're going to meet in the Keys. <laughs> I fish down here a lot. I'm a writer. I guess. You know. You're a writer too. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, oh, you can be out. Do you mind being on my YouTube? Nope. <laughs> okay. Actually, I took that to see one, and I met. Uh huh. You're going to point that and he called Hemingway Papa. Very cool. And he told us all about his adventures fishing. Nice. And that's where Hemingway got his information for the uh, old man in the sea. Wow. Mm. For real. And it was an amazing event in my life. Very impressive. Was down here twice. Well. well, that's where my um, my parents actually honeymooned in 1955 <laughs> in Havana. <laughs> Ain't going back. Well, actually, they're the nicest people on the face of the earth. Mm -hmm. They're just wonderful people. Mm -hmm. Poor, they're poor. <coughs> and on the other hand, the governmental officials, you know, you've got a guy standing there with an NK-47. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the doctor comes aboard and checks you for infectious diseases like... Whatever. Mm -hmm. It's got grease under his fingernails. Wow.